signal friends today let's see the bitcoin analysis we prefer the try to see our telegram free channel here you will get the free trading signal and if you observe the in this telegram you will find all our update and every day for who the market is going on in the single telegram you will get many of the things so join it and follow us in the twitter instagram as well you will get the maximum update if you like these videos, try to subscribe this channel and send these videos to your valuable friends and family. Let's see yesterday, it has been taken a wrecked position in the market. Why this has been happened, I will explain you. Why this, this thing is happened, this is because of the MTX GOG and America had been moved their Bitcoins to the exchanges. In this sort of type of transaction came in the market, but the street was not a uh, right tweet. It has been a wrong information. Many of the, these things already I explained in our Telegram channel. One who follows our Telegram channel, they will get each and every update within a 30 seconds before the market it you are going to get. So friends, right now let's see the BTC. In the BTC, if you observe that in the daily chart view, we can see that we can it is forming a nearly like a pattern of the trend line where you can I am expecting that the Bitcoin can consolidate like this it can go upwards it is like a falling wedge and if you observe that it is like a ascending tri descending triangle so in this descending triangle we can expect like this same move from the Bitcoin before that in the six hour time frame why I am explaining the six hour time frame it was a very important day before yesterday if you observe that in the six hour time frame we got the clearly bullish indication from all three indicators now we are observing the in the 6 hour time frame again if the bulls are taking a charge but how much time they are going to take the charge we can we are let need to see from the market and if you observe that the important support is 27,000 and the 26,500 and 25,500 maybe the Bitcoin going to test these support areas also why because the gap is there and I will show you that Bitcoin has the gap if you see that this gap to fill this gap yesterday this erect has been happened it is very normal thing there is the negative news also affected but technically there is a gap to fill that gap the bitcoin candle has to came here if you observe the properly previously that also if you observe that to fill the 80 to 828200 gap the same thing happened again one more gap is here that important gap is 20500 let's see how the gap is going to fill and in the longer time from perspective if i if you see here you will find that already this gap also has been filled. Maybe the next gap is going to fill is 35,200 definitely. I mean, the next move is 35,200. After filling that gap, again we are having very big chances to touch 37,500. Next definitely it will take another correction till 20,200 gap. Then if you observe the ETH, the ETH properly if you see that the same thing how the BTC is moving. ETH is not moving that much. Why? Because if you observe that here also, a clear bullish divergence is forming in the market. If you see the clearly bullish divergence. Observe here with the RSI and the market. If you see this trend line, if you observe the proper bullish divergence. Thus, divergence is take place in the weekend. Why? Because the weekend, our unnecessary whales will come and they will move the market. I am expecting that tomorrow and day after tomorrow, maybe the chances have more to the market upwards and the same the way 18,330 and 17,000 sorry 1,779 is the next support for the ETH and the next important thing is the USDT dominance if you observe that the USDT dominance it is now forming again one more bearish harmonic pattern if you observe here it is clearly looking at a bearish harmonic pattern if you see this here BTC is taking like the same thing it can extend till here also if you observe here let's see how the market will take charge why because right now yesterday and day before yesterday the both days has been the market moved in a little bit bearish and a macroeconomic perspective which has been not quietly a bearish not quite a bullish and if you observe that here also the same thing happened the last video analysis i explained here if you observe the proper divergence both if you observe the proper divergence has been taken that divergence taken place to market move this much direct upwards but let's see the bearish harmonic pattern how it is going to play uh, already it started bleeding here they may taking the support from here again it can touch here we have to wait from the market and the next important thing is SP500 index. SP500 index is literally falling here. 
I am expecting that the SP500 index next support area is at this level. If you see the 3944 and the next important support level will be this 3804. Let's see we, what are the support levels the SP500 index is going to have. And today is a very important day because American GDP data is coming out. You see here advanced GDP is coming out and tomorrow is also most 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 important day. This board days will decide the market how the interest rates are going to be. Tomorrow employment claims is there. And if you observe the market outer view, in the market outer view sentiment, again we are seeing one more negative thing that SOP are short term profit realize. The short term realizing profits means the short term holders are making profits again. Once the short term holders are making profits again, they will try to sell. Once they are trying to sell, the pressure is coming in the market we will experience again the bearish scenario means it is nothing but a big not a big bearish but the one who are in the profit they are started selling but if the new investors are continuously buying those coins which are sold by long term or a short term that is best for the market means that shortage is covering by the new one and if you observe the coin based premium it is purely a positive yesterday and today there is a good sign for the market and one more thing if these if funding rates in funding rates if you observe that properly the funding rates are bullish and the open interest is also not good as much but it is okay for the market but i already telling you in weekends try to be avoid that rate why because when you have a clear area then only do the trade and if you observe that the both is the it is not purely a selling sentiment but i am expecting that the both are fighting now it is like a probably consolidating period and one more thing i need to tell you is if you observe the bitcoin dominant it is a key level if the Bitcoin dominant is going to cross this area, maybe we can expect a big move in the markets, not in the upwards. It will be that move will be a bleeding. That's why I'm expecting that if the Bitcoin started dominant started break the 48 level, and you will start seeing the market is going to bleed. That's why ETH is not clearly a bullish scenario as of now. So we have to wait for the ETH consolidation. BTC is moving fast now because of the high range of dominance here. And if you observe the BTC shorts and long, first if you see the long ratio, the BTC long has been here, yesterday it has been closed. Now if you observe that there are no new long positions are taking place in the market and if you see that the short positions are also not taking too much but in the last 24 hours there are some shorts are building. Again they, if they are making the profit means if the red candles are coming means they are selling, means they are selling in their pro, uh, coins in the profit. So Let's see how the market is going to take place. So this is the today's update. If you like this video, definitely in upcoming days we are going to give you a wonderful videos and we are trying our level best to give a good content in the market. So there will be a little problem in English or uh, this video quality maybe. We are new to the making of the video but we will improve ourselves. If you have any doubts you can ask in the comment section and in the description we give a telegram and I give my personal telegram ID also in the description that the telegram crypto vultures if you contact me I will give you all info if you have any doubts I will clarify and there are any changes we need to and if what are the next levels of Bitcoin if you are observing try to comment thanks for watching try to subscribe our channel stay tuned with crypto vultures have a nice day Sam.